friends welcome to technique this is normal here and in this video we'll talk about the android 12 update for the ico z3 5g so ico z3 was announced a few months back uh, as uh, uh, a mid-range smartphone price was around the 20 to 25 thousand price segment in india and it came with a really good hardware it's a 5g device and it came with uh, the uh, android 11 update and also it had the fun touch choice now ICO has uh, rolled out the Android 12 update. That's really something impressive from ICO because this is one of those devices in the mid-range segment uh, to get the Android 12 update uh, uh, right now. So none of the even none of the premium devices have even got the Android 12 update. And at this time, uh, ICO is offering Android 12 for the ICO Z3 5G. So let's have a look at uh, the UI, the features, uh, uh, the uh, the, uh, the IQ Z3 offers with Android 12. So we already done the Fun Touch OS 12 video. So in case you are not uh, seen that, you can go ahead and see that video. So we will not be repeating all those points here. We'll just have a walk around of all the features and UI. So let's get started. So this is the home screen. Uh, you can see that app drawer is there the notification toggles are there so a lot of changes with respect to android 12 so let's see that so first is uh, the quick toggles and the notification area so you can see here quick toggles on the iq z5 was kind of different now we have a slightly different ui here so here you can see that uh, the notifications are also grouped and you can see that the edges have curved uh, that is a new uh, uh, UI based on Android 12 you can see that uh, the notifications have a rounded edge now the toggles are also changed the design of toggles was kind of uh, squarish on the uh, fun touch OS 12 now it's kind of again uh, circular in nature then uh, you can also see the edit option here you can edit uh, the tools uh, so there is an option to edit so that has uh, been made in here as well so now if you go to settings you can see that again not much of a change but uh, you can see that uh, the settings has been given a slight uh, modification uh, the uh, grouping is more or less similar to what we've seen on the uh, fun touch os 12 uh, and uh, here you can see that system uh, you can see that all the options are there uh, the system navigation option so uh, three button just uh, navigation is included then uh, multi turbo global search uh, uh, then uh, other options like phone clone are included then uh, if you go to uh, the about phone you can see the android 12 uh, fun touch os 12 and you can see that the android 12 version so this is the latest version so android 12 uh, is now running on the iq z3 5g now one thing what we notice that the app drawer again uh, not much of a change uh, one compared to the android 11 fun touch os 12 and uh, the android uh, 12 fun touch os uh, 12 so you can see here apps and widgets so you can see here uh, these are some new things like uh, this uh, nano music player then uh, clean and uh, speed uh, uh, widgets are included so these are again available in android uh, i mean the android 11 version of the fun touch os 12 uh, here again it is there apps and widgets are arranged uh, here and the icons have been slightly given modifications uh, when compared to the android 11 version so here are some changes here in terms of icons and how the uh, how it looks and feels now you can see that the widgets wallpaper home settings are also quite similar not much of a change here now one uh, change is this uh, uh, this uh, mini player or nano music player so you can it can play actually music from either uh, the local storage or uh, spotify so two options are supported so you can uh, play music from either of them so that's one uh, change uh, with respect to this then uh, you can see that uh, even though dark mode is turned on you can't see the dark mode on the app drawer that's that was the case with uh, the android 11 version as well so here also you can see here i have just uh, turned off turned on uh, dark mode you can see the dark mode is turned on even then uh, the settings panel is uh, dark mode uh, here you can see settings is again dark mode but the app drawer remains uh, uh, the normal uh, light mode not the dark mode again this is something which we haven't uh, got an idea about why this dark mode is not applied to the app drawer so that's the same case here as well now if you look at the multi uh, tasking or uh, app management you can see here quite similar you can change the layout uh, so this is something which uh, you can have the vertical or uh, the side by side layout and then uh, close everything then uh, you can see the dynamic effects again lot of additional uh, options uh, like uh, uh, enhancing the dynamic effects ambient light effects home screen transition facial recognition animations all these are included again nothing new here display you get the 120 hertz refresh rate uh, so those features are remaining same same here as well now let's see the camera ui so you can see that uh, camera UI is in change, but slight uh, change I would say. Uh, 
not much of a difference in terms of look and feel but uh, overall it looks good actually uh, you can see that options here so quite similar nothing much change again but uh, the grouping is kind of dif different uh, slightly different here apart from this you also get the android 12 features like uh, uh, the option to give uh, approximate location to apps instead of giving the actual lo uh, location location consent and apart from this uh, if you don't use an app for a quite a long time then uh, the uh, the um, the permissions are revoked so these are android 12 features so that comes in here as well now the uh, the download size is approximately 4 gigabyte in size and uh, you can download uh, we got it as an OTA update so you can uh, uh, try the settings uh, about phone or other update and check if you have received the update around 4 gigabyte in size uh, and uh, now right now our IQ Z5 or other IQ Z3 is running Android 12 so that was the Android 12 update for the IQ Z3 hope this video is useful do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day